So let's say you have an image where the horizon is very crooked. All you have to do is hold the right mouse button, drag it out, release it, and then your image will automatically straight out. Now let's say you want some guidelines. You can click up here, you will see the guidelines, and then with your right mouse button, you can also change the overlay colors. So right now they are yellow, but we can make them red or we can make them gray or whatever we like. Now we can also change the type from rules of thirds to metering or harmonious triangles. And that will give you a different perspective with this tool. Now let's say you're done with your image. You can take a snapshot by clicking take snapshot. A snapshot will be taken. Now let's say you go back up here, right? You can press the history stack, but you want to redo everything that you did. Now, rather than redoing everything, because now I can select the snapshot and I can, you know, see a before and see an after, but rather than redoing everything, I can just click this little symbol right here, restore snapshot into current history, then it pops back and we've got our image back again. Now, another great tool is duplicating your image. Let's say you want to make two versions, a color one and a black and white one. We can now duplicate this image and a second version will pop up. Now, if we go back to the original one, Let's go with the lens correction due to the camera being used. Now I can have my previous one, which is the first one. I can select that. I can have a look. But with a second version, I can do all kinds of different edits and then see which one I like best to use. The final tip is that you can go up here to the quick access panel. And there are a couple of preset options or widgets or modules or whatever you want to call it. Now, if you want to add or remove something, go up here, right mouse button, and then here is everything that you can remove. And here's everything that you can add, or you can choose to go to all available modules and then just add one you want yourself, right? So let's say I want the contrast to be gone. I click that and now it's gone here. And that's a great way to customize this menu, the quick access panel with all the modules or widgets that you use most in your images. And that saves you heaps of time.